हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज अमोल मोरे एंड वेलकम टू अवर चैनल सोल्यूशन टू ब्लैक बुक नाउ टूडे वन ऑफ अवर स्टूडेंट हैज आस्ट एज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग मैट्राइस चैप्टर क्वेश्चन नाउ दिस क्वेश्चन इज ए एंड बी आर टू स्क्वेयर मैट्राइस देर ऑर्डर इज थ्री क्रॉस थ्री एंड दे हैव ऑल्सो गिवन एज ए बी टू बी ए बी ए टू बी बी एंड वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट ए प्लस बी द वोल रेस टू सेवन नाउ दीज आर नॉट जस्ट नंबर्स okay so that you can apply what is a plus b the whole raise to 7 we know the permutation combination binomial theorem and everything we know the formula for a plus b raise to 7 also but you cannot apply that over here because a and b are not just numbers but they are matrices so they should be properly multiplied and no formula should be applied okay so what i'll do a plus b the whole is to 7 doing that is difficult because we do not have any sort of formula for that so i will do this i will find out a plus b the whole square so a plus b the whole square is simply a plus b into a plus b where a plus b is one matrix and a plus b is other matrix so let us multiply a multiplied with a plus b and plus b multiplied with a plus b the order of multiplication should never be disturbed because multiplication of matrices is not just like numbers okay do not commute them so a into a will be a square a into b will be ab and b into a will be ba and b into b will be b square okay now there's one more thing which you need to understand is that you need to understand what is ab ab is nothing but a and what is ba ba is nothing but b and then b square okay so what we are getting exactly is a plus b the whole square is actually equal to a square plus a plus b plus b square okay now we know one more thing that they have given us ab should b equal to a now let us say we post multiply both sides by a so what we will get a into a so the right hand side turns to a square and left hand side you can see b a but what is b a b a is nothing but b so this will be a b so all you can see is a square is nothing but a b but ab is nothing but a so you can call this as a so a square is actually equal to a okay then similarly ba is nothing but b so let us post multiply both sides by b so we will have bab is equal to b into b b square now you can see that ab over here is a they have given us so this will be b a is equal to b square but b a is given to us as b therefore b square is equal to b so basically what we have is a square equal to a and b square equal to b so let us write down what is a plus b the whole square so a plus b the whole square was a square but a square was a so a square was a then a plus b and then b square was b so definitely what you get is 2 times a plus b so we have gotten a plus b the whole square to be 2 times a plus b let us find out okay we were over here so i'll write down on the next page only that a plus b the whole square was found out as 2 times a plus b but we are okay again i missed the page i'm missing the page again and again okay so we are actually needed to find out a plus b the whole raised to 7 so there will form a pattern and utilizing that pattern you can automatically get the answer so let me help you with the pattern let us say we need to find out a plus b the whole cube a plus b the whole cube can be written as a plus b the whole square into a plus b but a plus b the whole square is nothing but 2 times a plus b 
into a plus b and then again this will be 2 times a plus b the whole square but a plus b the whole square is nothing but what again 2 times a plus b so this will be 4 times a plus b okay so a plus b the whole cube is actually equal to 4 times a plus b and a plus b the whole square was 2 times a plus b so let us guess the pattern what will be a plus b the whole raise to 4 definitely every time is it is getting doubled so now it will be 8 times a plus b that is the pattern right a plus b raised to 4 can be written as a plus b cube into a plus b okay i'll show you one more time this pattern how did i get this then you may have a better idea so this i will write down a plus b the whole cube into a plus b right and a plus b the whole cube is 4 times a plus b and then again i write down a plus b so this will be 4 times a plus b the whole square but a plus b the whole square is 2 times a b so this will be 8 times a plus b i think you got it that every time it will be doubled so for square it was 2 for cube it was 4 for 4 it was 8 so for phi it will be 16 a plus b and for 6 it will be again double 32 a plus b and for 7 it will be again doubled 64 times a plus b okay so a plus b the whole raised to 7 is coming out to be 64 times a plus b so the correct answer to this question is option number three i hope you liked the video and understood the concept the concept is from a b equal to a we got a square equal to a and from b a equal to b we got b square equal to b thank you for watching the video guys and i hope you like this video if you like this video please please comment on this video and do spread the video and do not forget to subscribe to our channel